Mega Church, Mega Herpes, a church without walls, Houston, Texas. This congregation has more than 24,000 members and a pastor who knew he had herpes and wanted to spread Welcome his member everybody. around. Welcome. <laughs> you are behind the scenes, the Church Without Walls preaching team. And we've come to a fork in the road. Meet Pastor Ralph Douglas West II. March 2018, Ralph met a woman online, had sexual intercourse with a woman, and transferred herpes. Several days later, after enjoying disease-ridden sex, the woman experienced an outbreak and sent Ralph an email. Ralph responded to the woman's emails, verifying that he, in fact, knew he had herpes and had caught it from his baby mama. He accuses him of knowing he had it, of giving it to her, um, you know, and there's other allegations about not caring about me, that kind of thing. The response, Murphy says, was telling. He never once denied that he had it or that he knew he had it. Why you keep telling me not to get married, though, man? I'm 37. I'll be 38. Sir, nobody wants to marry you. You have herpes. What, what in the world? What's going on here? We'll stop the kingdom from advancing. Now, here, here's where I take issue. This is Ralph West Douglas Sr. Sr. knew about the lawsuit and about the allegations of his son giving herpes to a random woman on social media. However, from 2018 to present day, Sr. allowed his son to continue teaching and preaching at a church without walls. And obviously, a church without boundaries. And I just want to know who in the world would go to a church to sit up to listen to a pastor who can't even preach. I mean, he can't, there's nothing moving about his message. The man can't even preach. I'd be asleep in the pew. Have life. I don't know about you, but I want to have restoration. Okay, that's enough, sir. That's enough. That's enough. That, that's enough. I'll be this thing off. I don't need y'all knowing nothing else going on. <laughs> 